Hong Kong keeps chasing the past. And I cannot understand why, because I'm so focused on the present. Uh, I'm excited about the future, but I'm so busy in the present that I don't even need to think about the future. And Hong Kong just keeps chasing the past. It, 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 it's stupid. Everything Hong Kong has done is self-inflicted, right? Uh, you know, in my opinion, they should have cracked down on the protesters faster rather than let it uh, escalate to, to, to how, it, how it ended up. And then the whole COVID thing obviously is farcical, right? The whole management of it being locked in for so long and then even when COVID exploded here, being locked in for so long, and then even when COVID was over here, being locked in for so long. And now they're just chasing the past. And I'll give you an example. So the Rugby 7 starts today. And that's our Super Bowl weekend, and I've talked about this many times and so forth. And up until 2019, we had so many clients and the city was just filled with people uh, for the Rugby Sevens, and I can't see it. Uh, my shop is not filled for sure. Uh, and, and, and the city doesn't seem to be filled. I'm sure, the I'm sure the stadium will be filled. But the problem is Hong Kong keeps chasing the past. You know what I mean? Talking about welcoming back mainlanders to shop and everything. It's just the past, the past, the past. It reminds me of my father, Reminds me of my uncle, reminds me of all my staff, right? They're just thinking about the past. I have never at one point ever in my life ever thought about the past because the past is just gone. I'm focused on you guys. You guys are my present, you guys are my immediate past, and you guys are my future. And that's what I do all day, every day, and, and, and that is why I'm successful. The blueprint for Hong Kong is to like return to normality before. I mean, you know, you can't return to something four years ago, five years ago, six years ago. Nobody's interested, right? You've just pissed on yourself with the protests and the whole COVID debacle. Do you think anybody's interested <laughs> in, in coming here and engaging with you? I mean, they're far more interested in coming and engaging with me. You know what I'm saying? I get asked what is my most expensive suit for me personally, this is it. It's a Pia Chanza, 50% wool, 50% cashmere suit. It is absolutely stacked in my signature details. And of course, I am gift wrapped in my 4D fit. I would love to talk more about the stuff that I said about Hong Kong and the path. We could do it on my Q&A later. Everybody help me to like and share the life. And an important thing is that uh, if somebody can tell me, a fellow streamer can tell me, someone who streams extensively, why my, my Instagram lives are timing out in one hour and how I can resolve that, I would appreciate it. So let's go to the first caller who is in Chicago and I hope he picks up the phone. Everybody like and share the live for me. Hi, bro. What's up, buddy? I hope you're home and not in your car. I'm not. You're looking <laughs> so handsome. Look at your baby cheeks, man. What's going on, buddy? Nothing. How are you doing? I'm okay, I'm okay, just working hard as always, trying to stay slim, trying to stay alive, you know what I mean? Uh, and that's Let's pretty much it. it. So are you definitely coming out this year? We're at a 25% chance, I okay. would say. Okay, so when you, when you do come out, right, whatever you can pack of the stuff that I've made you, pack it, as long as it's not a hindrance, okay? Come in so we can do a critique in person and I can touch up anything for you, and of course I will be free okay. of charge. There's no charge whatsoever. Okay. If you know what I mean, uh, you know what I mean. I, I would gladly do. You don't even have to buy anything new. I just want to fucking hug you. I would stop it. No, I just want to hug you, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I have to hold you to a three to a two day suit. I'd have to hold you. <laughs> All right, we'll talk about that in person. Um, I'm glad everything is great in your career. I'm glad you're getting a lot of use out of the stuff that I made you. This is fantastic. You know what I mean? Thank you. I think more than. I think you know me, you've watched me for a couple of years now. I get so much pleasure from my clients using my suits. More pleasure than them coming back to me to buy another suit. I absolutely get so much pleasure uh, from them uh, uh, continuing to get value from my suits because that is the best poison. That is the best infection. It infects and poisons everybody around them. You know what I mean? In a positive way uh, and so forth. And their friends end up coming and seeing me. Now, let me turn the camera around and let's get into this, okay? Yeah. So. It has, uh, you know, I've made a lot of suits for you, but it's also like, I would say it, it's very good because about six months gap in between each order or there or thereabouts, right? So I always want to pay you the respect of, uh, of talking you through all the options once again. Now, I love the fabrics, uh, without a doubt. Um, this 
is your Marzoni cloth, the purple and maroon. Isn't it phenomenal? It's fantastic. Right? And, and ha heads, hats off to you for having the balls to wear something like this. You know what I mean? Not every guy is like that. Uh, and I love it that you are. Just such a nice, such a nice cloth. It is just fantastic. And then as per your request, this is the black, plain black for Nick Mears, all wool. Okay, so this is also Marzoni, brother. This is also Marzoni. And it is a solid black, all wool, just as per your request, okay? Wonderful, wonderful. I couldn't be happier with your fabric selections and they're so starkly different from one another. Now, linings. This one is for your black? Nah, I don't like that, no. No, and this one, did you, I t did you identify this one as well? I think so, yeah. Okay, so this one in the, this, you haven't had this before, right? So this is ideal in the black. You're good with that, right? That's just rock and roller. It's gonna look so amazing. Wonderful. I couldn't be happy. And what are you thinking about for the purple? I think that elephant, the blue elephant. Yeah, the blue elephant is fucking A, bro. You are so on the money, man. You are, you are absolute superstar. The blue elephant is so good. Where is that bastard gone? Where's my elephants? Elephant like Lord Ganesh, you know what I mean? You know who Lord Ganesh is? Uh, He's the elephant god. Oh and my god, I figured I didn't want to make that assumption. No, no, you can assume anything with me, bro. Everyone assumes that I'm a uh, homosexual uh, child uh, molester, you know what I mean? It's all good. This is your elephant, right? Yeah, perfect. It's such a beast of a lighting, right? I think it's incredible too. I'm so happy with your choices. Absolutely so happy with your choices. Okay. The good thing with you is I'll tell you is I know I can't select buttons, so that's you. Yeah, yeah, and we'll talk about buttons once I get the, an idea of the style that you're after, okay? So let's start with the black suit because that's easier, right? Okay, uh, all right. Now, what is, your, uh, what is your usage for the black suit? What are you thinking of doing with this black suit? Uh, weddings and business meetings, but very conservative Jewish weddings. Mm -hmm. So zero flare, just put it on and make me disappear. Okay, I understand. So then one button or two button or three button? Two buttons. Okay, three roll two. Can we decorate it a bit with a three roll two? Yeah, let's, we can do that. Let's do that. <laughs> I think that's better. Okay, and then a... Um, a peak lapel like I'm wearing or a fish mouth? What do you prefer? More conservative or more flashy? More conservative. Okay, so I will do a fish mouth lapel for you. All right. I have a new style of three roll two. I've already done a couple of videos on it and stuff. Okay. Uh, it is more compact. So it will be my new style compact three roll two. Okay. Uh, what does a compact three roll two mean? It just means the, no, the, the single button in the middle, which is the only button you're gonna use, all right, is in the normal place. The th second button is just a absolute pinch higher, and the third button is just a pinch lower. So it just gives you a more compact, wasted look, all right? It's just a bit more contemporary. My job is to keep you ahead of the curve, or at least on the curve. There's no point in building stuff backwards, okay, brother? You just trust me on that. Perfect. Okay. Do you like vents in the back of your jacket? Yes, double vents. So double vents, I keep them short, the size of your butt, or full on, like an off-the-rack suit? Uh, short. Okay, great stuff. You are a big guy, so I'll give you soft American shoulders, okay? Yeah. The po breast pocket will be a Barquetta breast pocket, okay? Perfect. With the curve and kick. All right, you want an aggressive barquetta or just a short barquetta like mine? Short. Okay, I think that we should go and do oversized flat pockets. So against the grain of what we've been doing. So I'm wearing undersized, I will do oversized. So Tom Ford size. Okay, exactly Tom Ford size. So Tom Ford size is like this. 
This is for a client of mine in, in, uh, in Houston, okay? So this is the Tom Ford size pocket, which is what I wanna do for you. Do you want two pockets or three pockets? Straight pockets or slanted? Straight. Okay, great stuff. So two straight pockets, Tom Ford size. Wonderful, okay. In the lapel, dot, 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 hand needle and thread pick stitching? Mm -hmm. Correct? Yeah, correct. And a single buttonhole, no color, all right? No color. No color. And then just a four button cuff overlapping, no color. Okay, great stuff. And no gauntlet cuff? Nope. We're doing straight, baby. We're just doing straight. And no plain, plain black buttons like this. These are Marzoni buttons. They're double stamped with Marzoni. Okay? Perfect. The pants with belt loops or buckles? And underneath the collar, the lining or the flannel? The lining. Okay, great. Now for this suit here, I would like to also do the compact three roll too. It's a brilliant style, but with a peak lapel that's quite narrow. Yeah, perfect. Okay, with this one, I wanna do a closed back with no vents. Okay, I want to do a mini gauntlet on the on the cu cuff. And this will be a narrow peak lapel. This will have the deep press stitch, the very finite line. Okay, because it's it's great with the checks. Can I do a double button hole on the lapel? One, two holes. Sure. Can we do them in light purple? Okay, great stuff. I want to do what's called a Tarzan cuff. Have you been watching my videos lately? Where the last yeah, button... No. Okay, so it'll go bang, 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 kaboom. Okay? Yeah. So a Tarzan. Uh, overlapping. And the last hole is larger and in pur light purple. Okay? Excellent. So good, my friend. We'll also do the lining we'll do the underneath lining the... the uh, we'll do the lining for the collar again. Yeah, lining underneath the collar and buckles on the pants for sure on this one because you yeah, want to be able to rock sure. any shoe. You know, if you told me black, you'll do uh, a belt loop, I would let you get away with that, okay? But on a purple suit, you've got to do buckles, okay? Yeah. All right, so for the purple suit, it should be this button here. And the Tarzan will be the white, the ivory. What about olive for the Tarzan? Yeah, I can do the olive for the Tarzan. Here, right here. You like the olive? I don't know. I liked it. You showed me the black one. I like the olive. Fucking, I love it. So should we do four in the blue and the Tarzan in the olive? Yeah, perfect. Fucking love it. Just when you want to take over from here? Okay. I think that's brilliant. Now, girls, do you have any questions for me? Yeah. yeah. You live in Chicago, so the jackets will be fully lined, okay? Yeah. No, soft shoulders. Actually, wait. Back. The black one, let's do less lining. So the black one, half lining? Yeah. Okay, so the black one is half lining, and then the purple one is full lining? Yeah. Okay. Girls, any questions? Uh, Nick, anything for me? Questions before we move on to shirts? Yeah, we're gonna do shirts as well. Any questions about the suits? Perfect, no. Um, wait, just excited. Okay. What did you have in mind for shirts? What's on your mind? Three white shirts. Three white shirts with pattern or without? With pattern. Brilliant. Then I have new stock that just came in yesterday. And I just started selling it yesterday. Come on over here. Okay. I have this beauty of a self-stripe, just a beauty of a self-stripe. I have this beauty of a self-stripe as well. So I, I, just, I don't wanna show you everything unless I'm really enamored with it, okay? So I love these yeah. two. 
this finer cell stripe here and this wider cell stripe here, okay? And then I have one shirt left in my Spider-Man. It is the most eccentric, interesting, odd fabric that I've come across in 24 years for a shirt, okay? It really is like a Spider-Man costume. And I've, I've been selling this like hotcakes and this is the last one left. Uh, it is, it is, <laughs> people love this shirt. It's crazy. Focus on these, focus on these. Just have them, focus on these, not on me. And then bro, if you want an old school Oxford, I have this amazing old school Oxford, which is super stretch. So I like that as well. So you get the texture, the Americana, but the modern stretch. So let's do, why don't we do one of these? Okay, very good to sample. And then which of these uh, uh, do you like? Spider-Man. Spider-Man? Oxford. Spider-Man, yeah. Oxford, and? And the, the wider stripe or the narrow? I would go the wider. The wider. Okay, the wider. just between Spider-Man, wider stripe, this Oxford. So let's uh, decorate these a bit. Now, what are your thoughts on button-down collars? Okay, do you like this cut collar, like this, the aggressive one? Nah. Okay, There's you like straight, no. you like straight collars, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm making you three shirts. Let's have a look here, yeah. all right? So this is very small on a big guy. These two, they're very Asian. This is okay. Ray Liotta, uh, Joe Pesci, uh, what's that fucking movie called? Goodfellas, okay? <laughs> this is fucking Nordstrom's Land's End toilet yeah. okay this is pussy american spread that you want to go a little bit wider but you don't have the balls to okay and so is this all right so based on everything i said i'd love to do the 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 ray liotta collar for you i, I also that would go good on the oxford no that'll go amazing on the oxford but hang on one second what's really hot right now is peaky blinders collars like that the round point with the buttons and then old school good fellas like this as well with the button downs so I would go with the Ray Liotta, the button-down Ray Liotta, and the Peaky Blinders, if you like them. Three and ten. We'll do two of them and three, one of them and ten. Okay, so Josephine, we're going to do the... Uh, then the Oxford we're doing in ten for sure, all right? Because that's plain. Mm -hmm. So we dress it with the buttons. And then the, the, the self-stripe and the Spider-Man we're going to do in the three. That doesn't need dressing, all right? Are we good? Okay, it will be a narrow placket front if you like it, or do you prefer hidden buttons or do you prefer no placket? Um, uh, just like that, that's perfect. I like the that's narrow perfect. placket. You like raw mother of pearl buttons like these or charcoal mother yeah. of pearl buttons like mine or a mix of the two? Uh, raw. Okay, raw so point. raw mother of pearl buttons, okay? Do you like in contrast color stitching in the buttonholes? Contrast color stitching in the button thread. No. So all white. All <laughs> Cut edge cuffs like this with a cuffling hole and a button. Perfect. Do you want contrast color stitching down here? Just on the cuffs? No, let's keep it white. Okay. Monogram, yes or no? Yeah, let's do NM. NM on the cuff and NM on the gusset, okay? Okay, inside the collar and underneath the cuff, would you like a contrasting yeah. fabric? Yeah, we did that last time. Okay, okay. so what I suggest is we use these, these guys here, the Oxfords, the light blue, the medium blue, the dark blue, the gray, light gray, and the charcoal gray. Which of these do you like? These are the cutting look of this. The three blues, I like the three ascending blues. I like the three blues with bro. We are singing from the same hymn sheet. Oh my goodness. Can she, can she, can she, can she? So I say, don't take my scissors. Okay. So in, Josephine, come here, please. The Spider-Man for sure, this side here. Sorry, excuse me. The Spider-Man, you know what? Let me rethink that. I got the Spider-Man, I got this. Where's the third one? The Oxford, okay. So, I wanted the Spider-Man is the most 
shit going on. So the Spider-Man will have the light blue. Okay, just wait. The uh, Oxford has the least going on. So the Oxford will be the dark blue. All right? Okay, just wait. The Oxford, the dark blue. Okay? And then the self-stripe will be the medium blue. Right here. Okay, I'm going to cut from this book now. Are we good? Nick, this is great, huh? Okay. One, two, three. Yeah. Then let me make the initials on each shirt marrying, ma uh, matching the contrast. Perfect. So you have three different initial colors, okay? And then, so the inside of the collar will be in the contrast fabric. The underneath of the cuff will be in the contrast fabric. And the gussets will be in the contrast fabric. The, uh, the initials on the gusset will all be in white. The initials on the cuffs will be in the contrast fabric color. Isn't that amazing? Perfect. So perfect. Now, no size changes, right? From your last suit and shirts. No. Nothing, we'll just keep it off the gray though. Let's keep it off that gray suit, that okay. sizing. So exactly like the last uh, suit that I made you. Bro, this was smooth and easy. I love it. We got it bust up, buddy. We got it nailed down. Love you, bro. Talk to you soon, okay? Talk to you in a couple of Peace. weeks. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. That was smooth as it came. I love it. I love it. Uh, everybody help me to like and share the live. Let's Joey, hate domain again. Okay. Nick, uh, Vic is going to be ready in one minute. Everybody, that was a great call. Two beautiful Marzoni suits. What a special suit the purple one is going to be. Can you please help me to like and share the live? Yeah. Vikram's going to pick up now. I don't know what is Vikram having. He wants a gray suit, right? Let's give Vic one minute. <clears throat> this is a great list, well done. Let's give Vic one minute. Everybody help me to like and share the live. I'll take questions after. And everybody, anybody can help me with this, this, this time limit on Insta, the live stream. It's really uh, bugging me out, you know what I mean? If any of you are fellow streamers out there and you can tell me why suddenly for the last few weeks, I had this one hour cap on, on, the, on the lives and, you know, give me a solution. Some people have tried to help by asking me to ask Insta for help. It doesn't help. I, I truly need a solution. So this is his choices here and these are here, right? Okay. And is this Vic or no? Yeah. Who is this, you remember? Uh, the uh, the, uh, the Europe friend. Okay, we'll deal with that later. We'll deal with that later. Sorry for the wait. Okay, let's go. He's ready. <clears throat> Vic. Hello there. You and me just get along great. Yeah, I am yeah, sorry about the telephone tag, but I'm finally glad we got each other. <laughs> no, but I'm saying you and me get along great. How good was that last suit? Beautiful. It's everything that you wanted, correct? Uh, uh, yes, it was, and everyone loved it. Yeah. So we're going to. So you remember the last consultation that we did was just stellar, okay? It was stellar. And the whole time that I was consulting with you, remember I was standing on the floor here and I was just imagining being you in that courtroom with the jury on my right and the judge in front of me, okay? All right? So I really don't need to do that again, and I don't necessarily even need to remember every detail from that consultation, but I know the direction that I'm gonna take you in once again, okay? All right? All right, let's see it. So, so here we go. So I already know that you need a gray suit. I don't need to look at this stuff, right? And so from, from what you've selected, this stuff is way too dark. It needs to, be, it, I need to know first of all, can the courtroom, can the judge, can they take a gray this color? Because the other option is, is one shade darker, okay, right? Which is that one. But if we go darker than that, bro, with your dark skin, you're going to disappear. It's still going to look chic, but it looks better on a white guy. Yeah, 
all right? Even I, even I wouldn't wear something like that dark in a suit unless it was like a blue or a black. Do you get what I'm saying? Can you see my brown skin? It doesn't look good. Where's the, when we get, so the handsomest on the dark skin is this. So I have a couple of light gray suits. I look very debonair in there. But what I, so, so what I want to know, is that light, is that too light for a judge? No, it's not. It's, it'll are work you, just fine. Are you positive? It'll be, yeah. Okay. So then this is going to be your suit fabric. All right. Now, yeah. bro, I need to save you from yourself. You're, you're not going to get the ohm. It's a bit premature. All right. Not immature, premature. I'm not saying we won't do it, but it's too soon now. We're still in building. Okay, right? Like, I don't want you to suddenly be ha hamstrung because you've got that lining inside. You, 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 I mean, your bench isn't that deep. So we're gonna go with this baby here, your second choice. Are we good? Um, between that and the peacock, what do you like? Still this one. Okay. The peacock is, I know, bro, I need to save you from yourself. The peacock is way too fucking strong for that. You're just killing the suit. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. It is way too yeah. strong. You got to trust me. Okay. The, the, this is a perfect marriage. You're getting what you like and it looks great together. Okay. Trust me on this one. So the buttons, very important. Do we go with a gray button like this, which we know looks great? Or can we get away with a dark brown? We could be so bold to go with a dark brown if you think it actually yeah, goes Yeah, I know it goes perfect. So I want to give it as much character without uh, raising eyebrows, all right? So now, now look at me, okay? So I want to make your compact guy this way. I want to keep the suit contemporary but very American. I want to keep the suit something that a judge will recognize immediately. So it's going to be a three-roll two, but it's going to be my new creation, the compact three-roll two. What is a compact three roll two? It's three roll two is is steeped in in American tailoring. Okay, all right. Before everything got homogenized, American suits from Paul Stewart, Hickey Freeman, Brooks Brothers, even um, Ralph Lauren. There's one more of them. Okay, with three roll twos. Okay, and then and then you know we had so much mass production driven by Brooks Brothers that that third button got lost somewhere. All right. So I want to give you the three roll two. Was that how I did your suit last time? Yeah. Okay. But a little bit more compact. So the last button here will come up just a pinch, not even a pinch. The, the top button here will come down. Okay. Just so it's a little bit more contemporary. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, I see that. Okay. Great stuff. So it'll be a compact three roll two, single button in the buttonhole. We'll go with a fish mouth lapel. So very James Bond. All right. Still in the notch wow. family. We'll go with the dot, 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 hand, needle, and thread pick stitching, all right? Four overlapping buttons on the cuff, soft American shoulders, all right? No ticket pocket. I still want, I want to do undersized pocket flaps for you, all right? It's a very light shade of gray that we're going. We don't want medium-sized pocket flaps. Definitely not oversized pocket flaps. Not for your size, not for the judge. So we're going to go with undersized pocket flaps. And since the suit is a light color, we cannot, for the courtroom, we cannot get away with slanted pockets. So it's going to be straight pockets like I'm wearing, okay? Perfect. We'll do a barquetta breast pocket, but a short barquetta. Again, we don't want to be shoving that pocket down the, the judge's throat, all right? And full lining for New York City. Double vents at the back of the jacket that are short, that are perfect for you. Okay, you're going to be walking around a lot, this, that, that. I don't need you to be so hugged in. You, you, you get what I'm saying? And then the pants, you want to do buckles or belt loops? I, I really like side buckles, I gotta say. Okay, let's go side buckles. Great stuff. Give me a flannel, yeah. the, the, the SV flannel book. Uh, Tazen? Taz? They call manhe ke nahi? Or bo flannel book day, please? Sorry, let me grab the flannels for underneath the collar. Everything else good with you? And don't worry about what my interpretation of the fit of your last suit is going to be, okay? Oh, uh, excuse me. Let me put it. Don't worry about what my interpretation of the fit of your last suit is, okay? It looks amazing on you, all right? I am going to, after this, in my team meeting with my team and my tailor, 
I'm going to make a couple of changes, all right? Every suit should be different anyways, okay? So I'm going to make a couple of changes, minor changes to the fit and stuff, and that way, uh, I don't think it's ever going to be a case of Roshan, I like the blue fit more than the gray, I like the gray fit more than the blue. Not at all. Because every time I build a suit for you, I'm going to be asking for this photo feedback, right? So I can keep you along. Now, in, underneath the collar, we could do this light gray to stay in the same family, but I want to have a bit of fun. Did we do that last time with the blue? Um, no, we didn't do it with the blue last time, but I like the idea. Let's do that underneath the collar. That's going to be brilliant. Yeah, yeah, that actually is a good contrast. I like it. Awesome. I'm so happy. Any questions, everybody? Vic, are we good? Any questions for me? Yes, everything. I'm not. I'm not going to take, take back on you now. Uh, Lovejit has brought some attention to me. Okay, that this fabric that we've chosen, the first pair of pants I made for you, is in the same fabric. You're okay with this, right? Yeah, I'm totally fine. Right, because that it's a great fabric. It just means that now you have two pants with this suit, which gives it more longevity. So no big deal. Not at all. If anything, it just yeah, it makes the suit last longer. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah definitely, one definitely. One uh, no, no, no contrast, no nothing. Pay attention. Okay, so Vic, let me get to work. I'll be back in touch soon. All right. When are you flying for the for court date? Twenty third. Out of here. Okay. No problem at all. Okay. I'll talk to you again real soon. Take care, brother. Thank you for everything. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Where is Aman? Aman coming? Aman is coming. For sure, right? Okay. Uh, everybody help me to like and share the live. We're going to call the king himself. Call him one more time. For Nava Project Nikal, the last one. Let's do it. The last one, don't you want to do it? Show those yeah, I can show these and do the last one. Okay. Hi. How's it going? Are you okay? Okay. Can I have the last the, the last project that's left? What do we have on project? We have to do project E, right? Or have we to do D? We have two more. We have the one in the FedEx box, and then we have. Now we go to e. Have we done ABCD? Yeah. Yeah. We've done ABCD. So then we have only one left. So there's an F as well? Yeah, yeah. Correct. That's in the FedEx box. Give me the things. I need to look at them. Okay. Okay, no problem. Okay, open the box. Let me open the box. It's going to be the last packet in the DHL box. Okay, we'll figure this out. Give me the project, the briefs. In this box? Sorry, bro, I'm uh, just, uh, I, I felt that I've neglected you, right? But as you can see, I've got a lot of shit going on. So it's not in the DHL box, right? It's in the FedEx box. No, it's in the DHL box. FedEx is the last one. Okay, I want to go in order. So let me open the DHL box. Wow. So I haven't opened these. Okay, this is E. Okay, I haven't opened this. So I don't know if Customs has done this. All right. So this is what, can I have the brief? God damn it, if this was a surgery, every patient would be dead. Yeah. <laughs> it's the truth, right? <laughs> 50 fucking times I said, give me the brief. Okay, this is a beauty. Can I have my notes? Josephine? Three inch fish mouth lapel, high gorge, two button front, gauntlet cuffs, bucketta breast pocket, half lining, pick stitch, regular size, two straight pockets, short double vent, small mm -hmm. roping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Project E, three yards of Xenia, interesting double face plaid cashmere with small amount of silk. Leading towards lighter side of fabric. All right. So, both sides of the fabric are beautiful. Okay? Why is there no selvage? Can you explain to me? It's just, uh, I bought it in the garment district. It's just the way they have to get it. Okay. 
So we have to use a way, we have to figure out a way to incorporate both fabrics, okay? All right, so we have to, we have to, uh, uh, we have to incorporate both fabrics. Go, go on. We have to incorporate both fabrics, no matter what. What are these straps for? That is for a project. Oh, uh, wait, let me see that. Uh, flip it around. This says Project E here, this says Project E here, and this is Project E here, and this is Project E here, and this Project E here, but this is not, the straps don't go on this blazer, right? Show me Project F. Yeah. You have it here? No, they're not blue straps. They're, they're buckles. This is this is for this one. This is Project F. That's for F, right? So I'll okay. So I'll put that away. All right. So what we have here is Zenia Cashmere Double Face. Now, do I have a label for this? Yeah. This is Laura Piano. Zenia 100% cashmere? Yes, that one. That one. Oh, is it? This is Laura Piano. Okay, so let me move these away. So this is the label. Sorry? Yes. Okay. All right. Now, I think that you should think about this and that there's no hurry in moving forward. We can always reconvene tomorrow. All right? Because... We can do the day after, the day after that. Don't worry, okay? All right? You don't have to go forward with it immediately. But what we do to use both sides of the fabric is the breast pocket, of course, we can do in the dark, right? Yes. Or the light. I, I don't know which way you're leaning yet, all right? I like both so much. I feel that you have a lot in this already, but potentially not enough in this, okay? But I don't want to twist you in a particular direction. That's why I'm going to make sure that we think about this. All right? This is just a chat that we have right now. And you can do another mock-up. Now listen, let me continue first. You could also do the flaps in the secondary fabric. Okay? You can do the gauntlet cuffs in the secondary fabric. You could do potentially the collar in the, second, in the, in the flip side. You could potentially do the lapel. There's plenty. I'll, I'll tell you what my, I tell you what my, I had a problem with this fabric because though both sides are magnificent, they're so opposite each other. I, I don't want the, the jacket to be that bold. And by using both the dark as a secondary too much, I think it's going to jump out too much. So what if we use the dark as the primary and the light as a secondary? Well, no, either way, the same difference. But um, I think you're missing a trick here. How much material is here that I, you sent me? I have, I have, no, no, it's only enough for one. The problem is, is I have so many primary and secondary jackets that I've had made. I kind of wanted this to be uh, almost all a primary fabric. Okay, you're breaking my heart, because but this is about you. So then I'm still, gonna, I'm still gonna swing to the darker color, and I'm still gonna tell you that we have time to think about it, if you want to. Okay. In other words, having it not facing down, but draped down, 
for some reason the light will look better. Okay, look, Ta Tarzan is going to drape both sides on me. No matter what, I'm not going to start today, all right? Okay. I'm going to let you think, okay. and I'm going to dialogue and everything, okay? And we're going to drape both sides, and then we're going to take a poll like we always do on who okay. likes what better, all right? And then you're going to go away anyways and think about my suggestion to you, all right? I'll, I'm going to tell you why I'm going to be so forceful with you. I'm going to succumb to you okay. no matter what, but I'm going to insist that you take time. Because this fabric is so fucking good, Art. It is incredible. I know. No, you don't. I, I don't know if you really know how good this fabric is. All right? You should have just bought both. It is so good. Right? And I think we can create something just incredible for you. All right? Okay. Uh, okay? I mean, this is fabric from the sky. Okay? It is 50% cashmere, 50% silk. So this is the dark side. Can we drape the light side on me? You want to take some screenshots? I think you should. I'm also going to get Tarzan to take some photos and I'm going to send them to you. Okay? No, I, I have it. No, I, I'm, I'm, I'm familiar with the fabric. I have a, a little, little piece of each. I just feel that we haven't made anything super dark for you uh, yet. Love gold, I'm on one Okay? Taz, take some photos and send it to him, no matter what. Alright, I love both. Either one will be great. If, if, I, if, I, if, I was, if this wasn't Project E, right, if this was Project 1, then I would have no qualms saying, yeah, this is the more enigmatic one. But because this is Project E, I think that the dark color is, we haven't gone in that region yet, right? That's why I'm leading to that. And then if we could incorporate both, I would be much happier. Again, this is about you, but you have retained me. You're paying me for my opinion, all right? So I will give you my strong opinion, uh, all right, as your bespoke tailor. But I, and then I'm going to insist that you go away in your weekend. You have a think about this. You also have the live stream that you can rewatch back. All right, I don't want what you to end up missing a trick on this. What does the, the team think about each? Just read, come here, stand over there. Okay, don't interrupt. Just read, you like the dark side okay. better or the light side? I like the light side. Just read, likes the light side. Tarzan, you? The dark is amazing. Tarzan says the dark is amazing. Sitel? Dark side. Sitel says the dark side. Durji? The light. Durji says the light, so we're even, two apiece. You, Mira? Dark. Okay. Mira likes the dark side, Lavjit? Dark. Lajit says dark, it's 4-2 in the dark. Wait, Josephine, all in one color or primary, secondary? Tarzan, primary, secondary? Primary, secondary. Primary, secondary. What do you say, all in one color or primary, secondary? Yeah. All Sorry? In all in one Sita color. says all one color. You, use one both, color. use one color, 2-2. Two, two. One color. One color, 3-2. I like the patches in the light and then on the, the full body in darker. Lajit suggests going for patches <laughs> in the opposite fabric. Only the patches, but nothing else. And nothing else. She said, don't do anything else. Do the patches. Tarzan saying we can even do the collar. There's a lot we can do. There is so much scope. Hence today's discussion. Hence, there's no way I'm moving forward today. Okay. Okay, there's so much scope. All right? There's so much scope. And this fabric is divine. Are you already have so many lights? Yeah, so, so everyone is saying that you already have so much on this color. Right. Okay. Okay? Um, look, we'll, we'll have a think about it. All right? We'll have a think about it. In the meantime... In the meantime... We're not going to eat cherry oil, man, chat. I have this for you. I don't think there were any changes whatsoever, except for the Sam's label, very nicely put in, as you can see. Yep. And the name tag. Yep. Okay. So this is going to be shipped out today, unless you suddenly tell me there's some issues with it. Okay. No. Toggle sleeves, which open vertically. Toggle front. 
which can be fastened and then positioned vertically as well. What would you call this? I have no idea. How do you come up with this genius? I really pull it out of my, uh, you know what? Yeah, you're a bit like me. I, I just love it. I absolutely love it. It's just brilliant. It is so good. It is so nice. So, 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 so nice. So this is golden, ready to go out with our own special inside touches that we covered last time. Yeah, this so one, fun. this one, I don't even know how you come up with these visions. You are just incredible. You are a genius. Okay, here's the Sam's label. Great. Here's the Sam's label, done. Yeah. And here is your name done. But oh my goodness, what a piece of work this is. Oh yeah, I haven't seen the buttons yet. Yeah, neither have I. I mean, this is just epic. Look at the way I have the collar turned up at the back, but look at the visual that it gives yeah, you from... The, for, the, for the most part, I'm gonna wear it like that. Okay, regardless of how it looks from the back, it's irrelevant. Look how I have it, how, how the visual is from the front. Yeah. It is just Absolutely. glorious, right? Glorious. Epic buttons. They doubled up, right? Look at this. Is this the right button configuration or wrong? Weren't we supposed to have another layer of buttons? So we're missing one layer of buttons. Okay, so then this is not ready to go. So we need to go yeah, back to the drawing board. The large, the large size underneath the smaller size. Yeah, so remember everyone yeah, yeah, yes. in the consultation? Uh, to get, yes. This is why I do these calls. <laughs> this, I love it. Look at it. But it's come out great, huh? It, I love the curve, I love the, it looks great. Looks great. Look at that! <laughs> wow. Look at the taping, right? And then you can see the tape edge all the way around. Right? So and nice. Because and because it's double-faced, when it's open, it, one side gives the dotted, uh, and then it's striped. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's sensational, absolutely sensational. Where are the other buttons? Aman has them or we have them? Aman has Okay, let me touch this up and then come back to you with it, okay? Sound good? Fantastic. So homework for me, homework for you, okay? And then you are definitely yeah. not free for me for next two days or one day? Just uh, tomorrow morning, I can't do. Okay, so... It was, actually supposed to be, it was actually supposed to be this morning and tomorrow morning, but I watched the live yesterday. Okay. How did you know you were gonna call? I couldn't call you today. You were speaking to the team yesterday, and I heard my name mentioned about tomorrow. But that's with another Scarborough project, right? So we're gonna wait for that's ready. Okay. Okay. Look, let's talk again uh, day after tomorrow. Okay. Yes. No. No need to send me pictures because I have the fabric here. Okay. But listen, I want you to have a think about uh, what we we've said. And I want you to, if, if we're doing something interesting and different, you do me another mock-up, okay? Of course, yeah. All right. Thanks a lot, buddy. Take care. God bless you. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. Okay. Flip the cameras around. Yeah, give me my jacket as well. Okay. Uh, you process Nick Mears. You also process Vikram Jagdish. Vikram, you need to look at the photo. Sorry? He's, he just needs to put the button on top, right? Uh, Nick Mears is... I don't need it. Nick is easy. Uh, well, nothing in life is easy. And Vikram, uh, if you want to look uh, at the photos with me, then look at the photos with me. But look at the photos in the meantime, so that when we get into the team meeting, you know what's going on. Hi everyone, how are you all? Any questions for me? Uh, I will take your questions. I will happily take your questions. We've got a great crowd today. I'm uh, uh, very appreciative of all of you. These are the pins on my jacket today. Uh, you give me normal questions, I'll, I'll stay with you guys. If you give me trash, I'm gonna leave. I do suits, I do jackets, I do trousers, I do shirts, I do coats, I do women's clothing, uh, and I appreciate all your love. Uh, uh, you know, it's just amazing work that I get to do all day, every day. Uh, the, 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 the questions, they free flow so fast sometimes that it's hard to, to answer all of you. 
I do vents in the suit jacket. I never said that I didn't. I think the first caller I did, um, did a double vent for one suit, a no vent for the other, and the second caller double vent on his suit. It all depends on the client and the brief, right? It, 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 nothing I do is like, like sort of dictated, right? I don't have one set style. Everything is different for, 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 for every client. Now, I don't work with Kevlar. Uh, and working with clients, yes, I am a master. It comes from being 24 years on the job. Uh, any color shirt goes with a navy suit, my goodness me. Any color shirt. The most expensive fabric that I carry currently is Piacenza fabric. Uh, we can do a full Vicuna Piacenza suit for you for about 10,000 US dollars. Uh, if you are in Hong Kong, you can walk in. But what if we're all busy and we can't look after you, right? Uh, ideally, you want to book an appointment with us. Do I have a degree? I have a degree in finance and economics from NYU. Uh, I have Laura Piano Fabric. It, the starting price, the most reasonable price, I think, is potentially 1300 US for a two piece suit. Um, let's see what else questions here. I think the Vimeo Vice suits are cool. Uh, they were an amazing fashion statement, and, you know, they've been. They, they had such an effect on everybody. I need about nine weeks to finish JP Hemp's. Z, I only have this business. Sunny, I'm located in Hong Kong. I mean, if you guys want to change your style, just start with one suit, see how you get on with it, right? And I can help you with that color based on, uh, 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 you know, what you do, how old you are, where you are, et cetera, et cetera. I've done so many modern takes on Miami Vice. Uh, I, 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 can't, I don't do show and tell here. You know what I mean? My, my, the pace of my business, the pace of my day is so swift and so dynamic that I, I can't just stop and do show and tell, right? I, uh, it, it's just, it's not the, what I do. I don't know anything about your wedding, Razi, but I am a wedding specialist. So if you want to retain me, go ahead and do so. And then we can do some in incredible stuff for you. I've, start, I've changed from 5 a.m. for the majority of my career to now 4 a.m. I get up at 4 a.m. and start working. I make suits for bodybuilders all the time and amazing stuff. I will gift wrap you. I will do whatever you want me to do. Uh, everything of arts is epic. I learned on the job from my tailors, Ryan Ellis. Uh, stinking scrot, it's a terrible handle, but yeah, it's good that you have an opinion uh, and, but, and you spread your opinion in a positive manner. Uh, I'm not interested in doing business with anybody. I'm very happy on my own. I'm from Hong Kong. I'm born and raised in Hong Kong. You can be gift wrapped by me, but you have to buy a suit first, right? Uh, in order to work with me, uh, uh, you need to send me your measurements through the measuring chart on my website. Then I can make you something amazing. Razi, I'm Indian. Um, uh, I do most of my workouts outside. I sleep from 10 to four every day. Hopefully I don't wake up in between. My hair is absolutely perfect. I think that I'm tall with a feminine type of body, uh, but I'm still very masculine and I'm wearing a suit every single day. So I don't think how, uh, I, I don't see how I can't serve you. My suit started 650 US. I have done intermittent fasting in the past, but I'm not on intermittent fasting right now. I appreciate all your love, everybody. My hair again, I will tell you is perfect. Thank you, Razi, I appreciate you. My website is samstailor.com, S-A-M-S-T-A-I-L-O-R.com. Uh, Alan Estrada, thank you for the love. Uh, I appreciate you, Rob, my whatever. Uh, for prom, I recommend going for a Burgundy suit, a dark burgundy suit. Tyler Jarvis, thank you for the love. Mart Marlon Riva, I will not move to the United States. I'm very happy here in Hong Kong. Ryan Ellis, I wear a tie every single day. Uh, how can they possibly be dead? Have you walked into every men's clothing store on the planet sells ties? So, I mean, don't take my word for it, but think about the question you just asked me. Are ties dead? You understand that any men's clothing store that you walk into globally sells ties. So, I mean, you, you may understand that. Uh, Junior Turner, I appreciate you. I tried your advice, uh, but it did not work out for me. This suit would look just as good without the Marzoni buttons. Don't worry. If you don't like Marzoni, you don't have to have the buttons. 
yeah, I can make a hidden a, a suit with hidden pockets. <laughs> My website is samstiller.com, S-A-M-S-T-I-L-O-R.com. I think, Rossi, if you go to Louis Vuitton, Fendi, I'm trying to fucking think, obviously Gucci, and Suit Supply, you will get some great ties, great, great, great ties. Blamley, happy that you're here. I appreciate you. Uh, whoever loves Marzoni, I'm with you. It's absolutely brilliant stuff. I have no plans to travel to India. Hopefully I will come soon. I ship to the United States every single day. Every client that I spoke to in today's feed, on today's live stream is uh, 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 from the United States. Uh, I only wear my own suits. You're asking me about taking a woman out on a date and whether you pay the bill or not. Obviously, you fucking pay the bill. And you're asking a guy like me that? Jesus, pay the bill, man. You're Be a man. I said the website is samstaylor.com. It's the last time I'm answering this question. S-A-M-S-T-A-I-L-O-R.com. A suit is 650 US. I get no more than six hours sleep every single night. I've lived in Hong Kong all my life. I need nine weeks to make a suit. I mean, you have stupid questions. Seriously. I, I import all my fabric from uh, the United, St uh, United States, <laughs> from Italy. I import all my fabric from Italy, <clears throat> not from India, not from anywhere else. I pretty much uh, import all my fabric uh, from Italy now and you know gosh yeah I can't even think where else anymore just pretty much Italy uh, I can make a Peaky Blinders suit sure no problem uh, China is the biggest country <laughs> population wise on the planet and I am very 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 proud uh, can you make a suit perfect as Tom Ford O'Connor suit Tom Ford O'Connor suit what is it Tom Ford O'Connor suit <laughs> <laughs> Talk nonsense. Uh, my day, it's, uh, it's 10.54 a.m. And it goes, okay, I didn't sleep uh, much in uh, last night. It sucked, right? So I'm, I'm not as chirpy as I normally am. But we still did three amazing calls, right? You got to see three different clients, one in Chicago, one in Manhattan, one on Long Island. Uh, the best thing to do is to follow me on Insta, right? You'll get all of me in one place, at Sam Taylor. So this is to you, TikTok best thing to do i mean I, I, is, is follow me on insta you'll get every single thing of me from my instagram so yeah i lived three years in new york i lived three years in new york whilst i was at nyu but of course i'd been to the united states many times before and then many 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 more times after so junior i mean i every guy is different right it's not like oh you're a big guy so there has to be a specific design for you right you're a big guy in the entertainment industry right there are big guys who are bankers right they're big guys who who do different sorts of things so every design for every individual is different it's irrelevant if you are a big guy or not that is not the relevance right the relevance is what usage do you need what usage can we derive from this suit? What is your brief, right? I need to figure out, and it doesn't take me long, right? That's why I call myself the suit whisperer. It's not like I'm talking to suits. I, I ask the client a few questions. I know exactly what they want. I want to get you the most utility, the most usage, the most va 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 boom from this suit, right? So whether you're a big guy, small guy, that's irrelevant. Your size is irrelevant. Who you are, what usage you're going to get from the suit, what usage, who your audience is, <clears throat> that is what is re relevant. Now look, Insta is gonna time out, 50 seconds left. I've done my one hour on Insta. Uh, I'll do a few more questions on TikTok. So if Insta, once it shuts down, you just jump on a TikTok and I will take your questions there. Uh, yeah, and just remember one thing, like I always say, I'm not dictating, guys, I'm creating. My job is to get inside my client's head and, and bring their vision to life. And if they don't have a vision, I'll still get inside their head and we'll bring something incredible to life. That is my success. I appreciate all the love for my son. Uh, let's see what happens with his cricket. Uh, right now, he's only 11 years old. He's having a good time. And my job is to just facilitate his enjoyment, right? Not to push him eh, eh, or, or force him in any particular direction. But I appreciate all your good wishes. And of course, 
as a father, as a, as a male, as a human, as an Indian, I hope he becomes a cricket star. Bye to you, Insta. TikTok, I'll stay with you. Thank